When I wrote Breathe, my first book, the biggest problem with it, the reviews were that it was too sweet and cheesy. So I thought, screw sweet and cheesy. I'll give you something that's not sweet and cheesy. So that's what I did. I started writing when I was nine years old. My mother would buy me notebooks and I would fill them up and she would read my stories. And of course they were fabulous because she was my mom. I did that until I was in high school. When I was in high school, my literature teachers and English teachers would have me write different things for them. So I guess since I was nine, I didn't know I was gonna be a writer and write books until I was a little older. I did journalism type things. And so it was a while before I realized that I was gonna, I wanted to write an entire book. Only when I found out my dad read The Vincent Boys. When my dad read The Vincent Boys, I was humiliated and I told him he needed to stop and he did not read to need to read while it lasts. He had read Because of Low and um, that's the only time. I don't care about anybody else, but my dad reading it bothered me big time. No. They're in my head and they're so real that I expect them to say it, so it doesn't surprise me. If my character wrote the song, then yes, I come up with all the lyrics to the songs in my books. I hear music when I'm doing it. The song that Jax did, that we had put to music, I sat down with the guy that did his voice and the guy that wrote the music for it. And I'm not a singer, um, so I hummed it and I kind of gave him the tune that I, I heard in my head. And he took the lyrics and the tune and they put it to music for me. I'm a people watcher and I think I'd take the different, let's see, what's the word I'm looking for? I think I take the different traits from Southern guys and I take their best traits and I put them all together and make a really great guy. This is not typically the way that the guys are in South Alabama or anywhere in the South, but I take the best traits and create that fictional character that way and now people watch a lot. Yes, I feel like they're very unreachable men. I have readers tell me that they want to move to South Alabama to find a guy like this. They're not going to. They're not there. Those guys aren't real. Maybe we should leave that out. <laughs> <laughs>